Hey guys, today we're going to make a sandwich for the ballistic barbecue contest. It's going to be a pretty easy sandwich, but first we're going to start with some applewood bacon. And what we're going to do here is put it in direct. Just like that. Alright, I got about six slices on there. I'm going to put the lid on. And just let it cook. Alright guys, right there's that bacon. Let's pull it off. Mm-mm-mm, bacon. Alright, now that we got our bacon done, we're going to add in some, this is not coconut oil, this is bacon grease. We'll add in about a tablespoon of bacon grease. Okay, now what I got right here is one large red onion that I thinly sliced up. We're going to add that in there. Oh, this is going to be a mighty fine sandwich right here, guys. I'm going to add a little bit of pepper in there. A little bit of cracked black. Then we want to add a little bit of salt. Oh, mm mm mm! I love them red onions, man. They smell so good. All right, we're just gonna cook these down for a little while, and we'll be back. Look at them onions there. I cooked them for a couple minutes. Probably uh, three or four minutes over the hot coals. And I moved them over here indirect. So it's getting a little bit too hot. So. They've been cooking over indirect for about five minutes or so. I'm just going to let them keep cooking indirect here for a few more minutes. And then we'll add our other ingredients. It's going to be good. It's going to be mighty fine, I tell you. Okay, those are starting to look nice. Starting to look nice and caramelized. They've been cooking probably for about 15 minutes or so. What do we do now? We add in some brown sugar. About a tablespoon. Nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and add in a little bit of garlic. I'm going to add in just, I'm using this uh, gar minced garlic out of a jar just because it's convenient. Maybe a teaspoon of that. What do we got next? We got Jim Beam bourbon. We're gonna go with uh Woo! Oh Lord! Look at that! Dangerous! Dangerous I tell you! Yeah, I don't recommend that. Be a little more careful. But we're going to do about a couple tablespoons of that. Nice. All right. I'm just going to let that cook down for about five minutes or so, and we'll be back. Man, that's looking smelling really good. I'm going to move it back over the direct heat there for a minute. I want that to get a little bit more thicker. Mmm, I tell you, that smells mighty fine right there, folks. It's gonna be a simple sandwich, but man, it's gonna be good. You'll see what we're cooking here in a minute. Okay, cook for about two minutes over that. Alright, guys, I let them cook for a couple minutes over the open flame and pulled them off right there, is what they look like. And uh, I'm gonna wipe that pan out, and uh, that's where we're, we're gonna cook our sandwich in the, the cast iron skillet. All right, guys, two slices of uh, nice Italian bread right there. That's Italian bread, and we got a little butter. We got a butter each side real good. Another butter right there.
It's softened somewhat. Right there we go. Nice, nice. Okay, let's get this side. We're having a little trouble with the butter, but we'll get her done. This is a grilled cheese, y'all. All right, we got both sides buttered. Now let's turn them over like this. Let me show you what we're gonna do. Okay, so we're gonna take a slice of good sharp cheddar cheese. A slice of good. Pepper Jack cheese. All right. Now, now we're gonna take our nice bourbon onions right there. We're gonna lay them bad boys down right there like that. Oh man, best grilled cheese ever, folks. And then our app, Wright's Applewood Bacon. Let's lay that down right there. Okay. Another slice of pepper jack. And then one more slice of sharp cheddar cheese. Put the top bun on. And we'll go outside and grill that bad boy. Alright. Lay that cast iron pan back on there. Let it heat up for a minute or two. We'll throw our sandwich on there. All right, y'all. Uh, right here's our grilled cheese. It's a pretty simple sandwich, but it ought to be mighty fine. Let's lay it on there. Put that butter in there. All right, we'll let her probably cook for about a couple minutes, then we'll flip her. All right, I'm gonna give it a flip. Mmm, fat. And what I'll tell you, I'm gonna put the lid on it this time. That way that cheese will get good and melt it. Let it go for about two or three more minutes. Pull the lid. Give it a flip. All right, I'm gonna pull that bad boy off. Mm. All right, guys. This is right here is my sandwich for the ballistic barbecue uh, contest. It's a grilled cheese sandwich. Yeah, it does look sloppy, but hey, it's a grilled cheese. The best grilled cheese ever. Mmm. My God. Mmm. Oh my. Oh my. There it is, guys. That there's amazing. So much flavor. So much flavor. And very, very simple. Cheers, guys. I'll see y'all next time. The bourbon, bacon, grilled cheese.